Welcome back to Archives with Elise. I'm Catherine McWilliams, the Communications Director for the Daughters of Wisdom U.S. Province, and this is Elise Franco, our Archivist Consultant. Today, we're going to be touring the Archives Room in the offices at the U.S. Province. And Sister Catherine Sheehan, our Provincial, is going to be joining Elise to take you through the room and show you some of the artifacts that have been hung here. So stand by and let Sister Kathy join us. Welcome to the archive office. I'm going to show you some of our equipment and then I am going to turn it over to Sister Kathy who will um, talk about some of the things that are displayed in the office. So first we have our digital photo frame. That was donated by Dr. Semmel, and it displays um, photographs from St. Charles Hospital. You can also see we keep in here um, photographs and anything donated to the archive that we are working on organizing and moving out to the archive room. And we also have our computer and scanner that we use um, for digitizing our photographs and documents. And you can see in the room that we've displayed a lot of the photographs, postcards, and artifacts that we've found while working in the archives. And Sister Kathy has done a great job of displaying them in this room and would you like to talk about some of the things that you've hung up? Sure, thank you Elise. As you can see this is not a very big room and I wouldn't say there was a theme when I started to do this but more or less as I found certain things that I thought I didn't want to keep hidden away in the archives room let's put them out here even if we have to change them around sometimes so that as people come to the provincial office they get a chance to see some of these things on this wall behind me are pictures of places where the daughters of wisdom have been and interestingly enough some of these pictures were postcards and I just found them so unique and um, I decided to just keep putting them up as I found them so there's no plan to the picture frames. You can see it's whatever picture frame I found and they fit in. But the theme is definitely places where the Daughters of Wisdom have served. On this wall here, we just have a couple of group shots. This one here is at Sound Beach and um, most of us will recognize these sisters. Um, this picture here represents certainly uh, from a time longer ago, and so uh, I'm sure there's people that are going to recognize people in here too. I recognize a few of them. As we move to um, this statue, this statue was laid in the cornerstone of Our Lady of Wisdom Academy, and it is a replica of the statue carved by St. Louis Marie de Montfort. And if we move along this same wall, we find this map. And on this map of France is listed um, or characterized by certain markings, the places that Montfort went to and were, uh, was a missionary to in France. This frame up here depicts when the country of France made a commemorative stamp in honor of St. Louis de Montfort. And if we switch to this side, and I'm going to just pull this door to the side here so we can see this corner better. This statue of Our Lady of Wisdom recently came to us and was donated by a graduate of Our Lady of Wisdom Academy. So we were very happy to have it and decided uh, we would place it here where we also have a statue of St. Louis Marie de Montfort and our doll depicting the um, habit of the Daughters of Wisdom. This little wooden um, plaque is a picture of uh, Montfort Academy in 
uh, is a depiction of Monfort Academy in Fredericksburg, Virginia, which is no longer there, but we still have plenty of stories and pictures to tell about that ministry. In this picture, we have the present leadership team on the congregational level of the Daughters of Wisdom, and this is Sister Antoinella, Sister Isabel, Sister Rani, the congregational leader, Sister Pierrette, and Sister Mary Wren. And if we go to above this cabinet here, we have um, the Canadian Provincial Council, Sister Jocelyn, Sister Francine, Sister Linda, their provincial, and Sister Anne Marie. And lastly, which is probably a picture that people will recognize as having been more recent, is the commemorative invitation for when the U.S. province of the Daughters of Wisdom celebrated 1949 to 2019, uh, our 70 years. It's Elise from Archives with Elise. And now that you've seen a few episodes of Archives with Elise, if you have any questions, you can email them to us at dowarchives at gmail.com. And you may even see your question featured in a future episode of Archives with Elise.